Yo, what's good, everybody? I'm Full Dokkan here, back with another Dokkan battle video, and today we've got the fifth episode of the Lorecon battle series, a series where I take just some canon teams from the series, lore-wise, of course, chronological order, chronological order. <laughs> Don't mind me, all right? It's like a, it's a little late at night, but it's fine. I'm still gonna do this video. We're still gonna have some fun with this video. And you know what? We're just gonna jump right in. We've got Android Cell Saga. As we can see, we are going up against Cell right here. I have taken a team. I've tried to be inclusive, all right? I've tried to be inclusive in Cell here. AGL Cell is here as well. The Androids are not here because, uh, look, there's only six spots to a team, all right? But we do have my boy Piccolo right here giving us the Piccolo fit. Are you looking at Gohan? Oh, yeah. He looking drippy. We do have Super Trunks. We have Agile Gohan, we have Physical Kamikolo, which is this fight right here. I really enjoyed rereading this fight, it was absolutely amazing. 17 and Piccolo just duking it out, that was just absolutely nuts. I'm going to do this, this cell, I mean this cell is just going to be very easy to go up against, honestly. <laughs> physical Piccolo, we already know he's going to need to stack, but I'm not giving him a super attack because I don't want to, alright? I don't want to give him a super attack, why should I give him a super attack? I just couldn't give him a super attack. Double super from Gohan, he does stack as well. The thing with these cell saga units is like they always make these units for some reason very 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 tedious uh work around with like this trunks for example he has to, a lot of things has to go his way i mean on this video a lot of things are gonna go our way because uh, this stage is not really that hard to go up against as you can see we've already done three bars of this guy piccolo didn't even get to super attack yet which is very nice hopefully i will be going for the double cell rotation and then the goku and gohan rotation a little bit of an extreme rotation for the villains and have a little bit of a beautiful little Goku and Gohan father bond rotation. We do have Super Vegeta here, but as we know at this point in the series, Vegeta didn't really like Trunks too much. I am going to keep these guys together, of course. This cell has to super attack, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, this guy has to super attack so he can keep on uh, getting even more attack. I don't really care about this cell super attacking too much, so I'm just gonna do that. And let's just get that Vegeta KO screen, if we can. Vegeta will be guaranteed critting, and he's gonna be one of the guys who will probably get us killed if he gets super attacked. Well, <laughs> let, let's just hope that he doesn't get super attacked. I mean, I can't, we can't really do too much Bro. else. We are getting super... <laughs> You love to see that dodge right there. I mean, we probably would have not died, and I would have rather him took that. But getting the dodge is still pretty nice. I don't care. <laughs> I will take that dodge, all right? I'll have the plus sound effect that I really love a lot. Oh, this Vegeta does stun. Oh, yeah, I, com I completely forgot about that. He does guaranteed stun on his super attack. That is very nice. All right, let me think right here. Look, this is, as I said, this is a pretty hard stage, okay? So I have to think about... Uh, it doesn't matter. I'm just gonna do this. I am... Uh... I'm not gonna use that active skill. I don't wanna use it just yet. I, I, I haven't seen enough just yet. All right, Trunks, let me just do this. Very beautiful. And now Gohan, my gold, 4.3 million. Let's talk about the Cell Saga a little bit. A very, very, probably my most enjoyable chapter that I have. I mean, not chapter, the most enjoyable saga that I have read up until now. I really, really enjoyed all the relationships and everything. I mean, Vegeta, a lot of people hate Vegeta on this saga. I think he's fine. I mean, he's a cool little character on this saga because at the end of the day, he's still a villain here. He's not a hero or not. He's never really a hero. I mean, you could call him a hero on Dragon Ball Super, right? But he's not really that hero. I mean, yo, 17, I'm sorry, buddy. I'm here talking about Vegeta. You're getting your ass absorbed by Cell. Hey, it happens. That's why I didn't bring 17, 18, and 16 here because they would be very traumatized and would not be able to work with me if they saw one of their friends get absolutely demolished like he just did right there. So I'm gonna do this. Our defense... They're not looking very good. I am going to uh, give that to Cell, and Piccolo is going to be very, very good. By the way, this form of Cell is so bad. I adore the first form of Cell because it gives you that fear. It has that fear in him. That is what that Cell has, and I really, really enjoy from that guy. He is absolutely amazing. Toriyama did such an amazing job encapsulating the fear and everything that that Cell puts into you. Even when I, when I was a kid, I remember this. When I was a little kid, I was like 10 years old or something like that. Like, Cell went popping up in my nightmares and everything. Okay, we dodged that. That is very good. I would rather get hit by some of these super attacks just so this cell right here can actually transform into his perfect form. That would be very, very nice. If you don't want it super attack me, you know, it's, it's fine. All right, I'm just gonna pitch your ass as is. I do have a strategy, though, of getting Cell out and getting Gohan out as well, and it is going to be on that physical Cell phase because he's gonna hit us very, very hard on that phase. All right, so Vegeta right here. I don't think I'm gonna do anything with him, honestly. Honestly, now that I think about it, I am not going to transform this Goku as well because we do need him for Gohan's attack to be up when he goes into Super Saiyan. 
to. So I'm not going to transform that Goku, actually. If we get Goku and we transform Gohan, then we're gonna get some very, very cool attack stats from Gohan. Really, really love what Toriyama did with Goku and Gohan in this saga, especially. Them training together, that was a very, very cool little moment. And after training, Goku being like, you know what, Vegeta? You're too weak, bro. You can go train. I don't give a shit. I'm gonna go spend some time with my kid. And that was uh, that, that was just very nice. I really like that part. It, it's very cool when Dragon Ball sometimes just stops and it just goes through a little bit of slice of life. I think that is very nice. That's a very cool little thing that Toriyama does sometimes, especially when, uh, when he did it at the beginning of the Majin Buu saga. That was very nice. We do get this, though. This is very, very good. We don't have the Usher here, but we are going to transform into Int perfect cell super perfect cell if you want to call it we are gonna get this as well oh yeah this is gonna be looking this is a little lore right here super trunks and then we've got this guy transforming and then we've got him going into super perfect cell bro just got her and then spot her out immediately he did not like that taste holy shit okay so that's a little rude but you know what i don't care because we get this absolute beauty out here so I don't want to use Trunks' as Usher here, honestly. I mean, I, I will try to not use this Trunks as much as I can because this Trunks is going to be very damaging. So I'm just going to do this. Yeah, let's do that with Cell, with my boy Cell right there. And let's just do that with Trunks. So Cell does need 8 orbs. We don't have 8 orbs with him right now. But this guy's on 8.2 million? Holy shit! Yeah, that's a lot of damage right there. Could you do it? Okay, good, good, good. We can see what Imperfect Cell has to do. 14! Bro, what? <laughs> Yo, what? 14 million? Holy shit, yo, Cell, chill, man. Okay, that, hey, that's pretty cool. That is from the point where he killed Trunks. That is very funny. He could have killed Gohan there. I mean, I already know he didn't kill Gohan because he just threw that shit because everyone was so weak that he didn't even know who was who, right? But he could have killed Gohan there, but he was like, nah, Trunks, and he just killed the trunks. Oh, that's an instant super attack. We're gonna be completely fine from that. We have 600k defense on Goha. That is very nice. I love this Gohan so much, man. My favorite ever release that they ever did was this Gohan and that perfect cell. If you can tell already, this is my favorite saga. I do love all of the sagas of Dragon Ball, but this saga in particular was just absolutely amazing. Wait, not 29k Gohan took right there. That is pretty lore accurate Gohan. But you guys know, there's a little fun fact right here. If you didn't notice this, Gohan in Super Saiyan, he thought Goku and Cell were holding back when both of them were going like full power. So that means that Super Saiyan Gohan technically could one-tap Cell. I mean, not really one-tap, but could bit the shit out of Cell. <laughs> because he's his Super Saiyan is way stronger than Goku's Super Saiyan, and Goku's Super Saiyan was like on par, kind of. Maybe a little bit weaker, but on par with Cell. So yeah, and Gohan really thought that, uh, wait, wait a minute, you guys are not fighting for real. <laughs> wait, there's no way. So yeah, I'm pretty sure Gohan could actually just bit the shit out of cell even on super saiyan but we already know gohan does not really like fighting too much and goku was the first person who was like ah oh, shit guy doesn't like fighting i should have probably not thrown his ass out here to fight this massive bug hey look at the end of the day it all worked out gohan got that beautiful uh, transformation which to this day is probably my favorite ever transformation sequence in the series that is absolutely unreal what they did with gohan all right so we're gonna do this hmm. no six orbs for him we are gonna finish it up here because at the end of the day we are stunning him. Well, that is very, very good. 8.2 million on this cell. We have not transformed with Gohan just yet. Now is going to be the moment where we will be able to transform because we're going to go into that physical phase. And that physical phase is going to hit us pretty hard. I, I can just slap Goku and Gohan on that first slot and they're going to get hit very hard. And we are going to transform with Gohan, which is what I really want here. We just want to get Gohan out. Okay, Vegeta, if you give me a double super, then we're cooking. I need a double super from Vegeta right here. Come on. Final Flash, bro. Cell just trolling Vegeta as well right here, acting like, like Final Flash even did anything to him. That was that was very, very funny as well. We, we already know how uh, Cell is not your usual villain. He is a little quirky. He is a little funny himself. He likes cracking some jokes and everything. But I really enjoyed Cell as a villain. I really, really did. His second form is ah, but like his perfect form and his first form is just absolutely amazing. I can't really wait for Dokkan to actually give us some Cell Saga buffs again. Like that's gonna be very, very very nice whenever that happens. And so this is the phase I was talking about. So 458 here. We don't have another Namekian, so Piccolo cannot transform. I don't know if Piccolo lives this. <laughs> We're back here. There we go. Super Vegeta. Yes, sir. Power Vegeta. 
Yes, sir, his Super Vegeta. Okay, so we're back at where we left off right here, where we just got absolutely destroyed with Piccolo. All right, so I'm hoping Vegeta does not suffer the same fate. Look, this guy is STR. This is what I really want to do here. We do want to get the STR unit in front of this super attack because that is going to lower our HP enough to where we get that Super Saiyan 2 go, huh? So hopefully it works this time around. Okay, Vegeta is getting cooked! And it's gonna work. Very good. 7 million on Vegeta as well. It's very, very nice. You love to see that. Very, very cool. With a final flash. We didn't get Perfect Cell out this time around, but I, I think it's fine. Perfect Cell did have his time in the sun. He had his time. And look at Vegeta go with a double super as well. Yeah, look at the final flash, baby. Oh, yeah. If we finish here, that's gonna be very nice. With a beautiful Gohan nuke. Because I do have the nuke in items. Of course I have the nuke in items. Come on. Who do you think I am, buddy? Who do you think I am? Okay, come on. You got to finish here though give me a crit one more he is giving me one more if this is a crit then we could be cooking come on no crit one more oh we didn't get one more we are gonna get this though which is very very nice i don't think this is gonna be a super attack again i don't think so but i i am going to get this let's go let's go let's transform here let's transform we, this is what we want to see this is the yeah yeah I mean, I'm saying we yell while he's crying out of anguish and pain and everything, but yeah. Look, I love that transformation. I absolutely adore that transformation. It's so good. All right, so you know what? I'm gonna do this. Let's do a Dokkan attack here because we're 100% finishing it with Gohan on the next turn. So I'm gonna do this. We do have Trunks. So Trunks might do a little too much damage for us. I'll try not to have Trunks do too much damage. I'm not gonna do all this. <laughs> bro, I don't care about all this, bro. <laughs> yeah, let me just fail this and you can just go. Gohan is going to finish this with a father song. Kamehameha. Look at that. A little off lore right here because uh, we do need Gohan to go up against Super Perfect Cell. But hey, we do get the KO screen. We do have the KO screen in the video. So that's a very good thing that happened right there. All right, so Cell is going to be fine. Trunks and Vegeta. I mean, I would rather none of them super attack. But they are going to super attack here. I mean, I could do something like this, I guess. But I'm pretty sure Trunks does not have his guard up. So, hey, look. We get cooked. We get cooked. It is what it is. Nah, you're not winning this time around, buddy. You are not winning this time around. I am going to get get my Gohan out and you are going to get absolutely destroyed. That's what's gonna happen this time around. Dodge this. Yes! There we go. Okay, that's very good. I don't think Trunks has it in him to actually finish here. He is going to do a lot of damage. He's gonna do a lot of damage, but yeah, look at that. 15.8 million. That's probably a little too much. Oh, that's probably a little too much. I think we're fine. Yeah, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Super Vegeta here, he might take a little bit of damage, but we don't really care too much. Look at that, all of the final flash, all of his power in one single final flash, and he doesn't finish, I mean, because he's Vegeta. Did you really expect Vegeta to finish this? Come on, <laughs> let's be real right now. Okay, a lot of Rainbow Warp changing, that's what I want to see, and <laughs> we do have chill, we do have best girl here. So I'm gonna change positions. Go again. I didn't give us anything, but it's fine because I'm gonna use 14 orbs with Gohan. I'm pretty sure that is going to finish it up. 1 million defense on him. That is very nice. And now let's just do this with perfect selling Gohan. Let me suit up. Let me get it ready. Bring it home, boy. Bring it home. Let's go. How much are you hitting for here? 36 million. That is amazing. Come on. Finish it, Gohan. Let's go, baby. Let your strength, whatever Goku said, 29 million on the crit with a KO screen as well. Absolutely amazing, man. Absolutely amazing. You love to see that. You love I love this KO screen. I love this saga. I absolutely adore this saga. Absolutely amazing. Getting the win against Cell here. And hopefully, hey, I want someone's like and subscribe right there. Thank you guys for watching. I really, really appreciate it. If you love this Lorcan episode and you want to see the previous episodes, of course, there's going to be one of them on the screen right here. There's going to be one of them on the screen. No way. If you enjoyed this Lorcan episode and you want to see more of them, there's going to be more on the screen right here. And there's going to be another video that YouTube thinks you will like. I don't know if you're going to like it, but hey, I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.